It's going to be a very busy weekend on Fort Lauderdale Beach as tens of thousands of country fans pack the sand for the sold out Tortuga Music, music Festival. It's back and a lot of big names performing, but the event not just about partying, it's also about taking care of our oceans and our planet. Local tennis Christian De La Rosa is live to explain. Christian. Well, and we were just here, right, five months ago for Tortuga, but that was the 2021 pandemic edition. It is back at its fullest and you said it it is sold out and so what does that mean for you especially if you're not here for the party well let's talk about that it, while you look at video of what this looks like out here traffic is going to be horrendous especially along seabreeze boulevard and south of las olas by the way there is no event designated official parking so if you can ride share Great. We've heard from some people who are even taking the uh, water taxi over here or biking over here. Let's talk about the good stuff, the good music, the Morgan Wallen, the Thomas Rhett, Luke Combs, Brothers Osborne. So much good music out here. And for most of the folks that we've been talking to, especially those who are from out of town, they're just happy to be here and feel normal. It is the best <laughs> feeling ever. Really a great feeling to finally feel a little bit normal. It's a lot better day, it's a lot bigger crowds, it's twice as many people and it just it's a great event. It gets people out and about and enjoy the music and it's gonna be a lot of fun. Louis, you said it off the top, Tortuga Festival also benefits the Rock the Ocean Foundation. Not only do they raise awareness, but they also raise money. Over the years they've raised two million dollars for conservation initiatives and i said this earlier louis you loved it plastic bottles plastic straws banned from the beach louis back to you i love that sustainability is the key thank you christian